Good rising, Scorpios. <laughs> I hope everybody's thriving and doing great things with themselves and in their lives. Growing, ascending, evolving, and being in alignment. So today, we're going to do um, a reading for your current energy. So we're just going to get into it. Let's jump right into it. Spirit guides, ancestors, guides. Type another reading for this energy spirit. Allow me to receive these messages clearly and guide me through reading these messages, spirit. Thank you. What is Scorpio's current energy? That just um fell out. We have that's the Eight of Swords. Um. <clears throat> hmm. So I'm getting two things. Hat card, two messages. Um. One of them is that you are coming out a situation that had you feeling very stagnant and stuck. You're coming out from that. And the other message that I got was that somebody is about to go through this. Somebody's about to go through this. Okay. <clears throat> Two of cups. I see a, a new union. I see a new union. I'm getting two messages for this as well because this is for a variety of people. Um, so when this is Scorpio, you are in union with somebody else, like a divine counterpart, like, you know. Um, for my other Scorpios that don't resonate with that, um, this was like an old connection from the past. Oh wow. So this is the three, four, five. Five of cups. And we got the moon card. Oh, look at what we have at the bottom of the deck, Scorpio. Justice. So Scorpios, um, going back to what I was saying, you guys, this connection, uh, this connection that you were dealing with in the past, it left me feeling, um, all right, so I'm back. Um, my apologies for that, Scorpio. But like I was saying, this connection left you feeling very hurt, very hurt this a complete narcissist a complete demon this person was a is a demon okay they're a demon they're not regular human people no they're not they're demons so 
they left you feeling empty like they took they tried to take everything from you scorpio everything absolutely everything they wanted to leave you with nothing and it and they were even wishing death upon you like they were even wishing death upon you unfucking believable like this energy pisses me the hell off, Scorpio. I'm going to be 100% with you. It pisses me off. So if I get loud, it's because the energy is pissing me the hell off. <laughs> okay? So, um, so, moving on to the moon card. Secrets. Secrets, Scorpio. I'm like really chilly. My hands are freezing cold right now. And it's warm in my apartment. So. Anyways. Scorpio. Secrets. This person kept um, a lot of secrets from you. Scorpio. Excuse me for a minute. I'm back. <laughs> So this person kept a lot of secrets from you. Um, this person is actually not who the hell you think they are or whoever they put, portrayed themselves as. They're not that. Okay, they didn't even, they lied about who they were to you, Scorpio. Okay, like I said in your last reading, Scorpio, this person is a demon, okay? They work for the dark forces and they made a contract in the spiritual realm to try and destroy you in this lifetime. So be very careful, Scorpio with you know people because not everybody we see with our eyes are human beings to be a human you have to have compassion for other living beings that's what being human means scorpio when i tell you scorpio when i tell you that this person is going to be feeling everything that they all the pain that they've caused you they're gonna feel that 10 times worse the spirit is gonna take everything away from them this is gonna be them scorpio this is gonna be them they're going to prison scorpio they're going to prison scorpio like bye bye have fun in prison have fun in prison you fucking dummy like have fun in prison that's where you belong that's where they belong they're not doing nothing um they're not doing nothing good for the universe they're not helping humanity evolve so bye Par all parasites must be eliminated all parasites must be eliminated. Okay. The divine, we're rising up. We're rising up. The chosen ones are rising up. So, bye. <laughs> um, also, Scorpio, they're about to be exposed. They're about to be exposed. The moon... Um, the moon il illuminates what's hitting in the dark, okay? That they are going to be exposed. They're about to be exposed on a lot of things, okay? If these evil people, um, if these demons, if they've, like, done like anything any crimes that's gonna come out 
That's going to come out, Scorpio. Okay. Let's move on to your Oracle cards. <clears throat> Did you guys see that? That card just did a 360. Hold up. <laughs> and what does it say? Embol Awakening. Look at that. Awakening. So Scorpios, a lot of you are going through an awakening right now. You guys are having an awakening. Beautiful, beautiful. Book of Shadows, Secrets. I am playing, y'all. Hold on. Excuse me for a second, guys. Hi, Scorpios. I'm back. Um, let's continue with your reading. Let's finish. wand intention the bottom I didn't get a chance to explain the book of shadows for you guys so I'm just gonna explain that to you guys here we have the book of shadows as you can see my camera's moving but the message that I'm picking up with this card is spirit spirit wants you to get into reading get into reading about magic and learning magic to protect yourselves from these demonic beings because you scorpios um a lot of you guys you are high ranking in the spiritual realm you guys are very powerful beings um this is in your dna okay this is in your dna okay you your ancestors were witches or warlocks or psychic mediums okay you have gifts scorpio so spirit really wants you to learn how to use those spiritual gifts because you actually need to learn that in this lifetime and so you can protect yourself from demonic beings like these like this okay especially if they're always like if these being these parasites are like looking for you moving through people through different people to get to you you know you have to learn how to protect yourself you got spirit guides and ancestors and some of you work with deities that protect you but you know if scorpio if you aren't already a bruja or a bruja Spirit is saying you need to get on that. You need to start teaching yourself, okay? It's in your bloodline, and you need to you need to reclaim who you are, okay? A lot of you are meant to be high priestess or a high priest and initiated into whatever it, whatever it is, um, whatever it is you feel more called to be initiated into so yes next card is wand intention so with this first of all scorpio intention is everything all right intention is everything so the message i'm picking up for this card is um for some of my Scorpios because I know 
there's some Scorpios out there that already know have this knowledge. Um, but be more be more intentional with um with what you do. You know what I'm saying? Like you guys understand? Be more intentional with everything that you do. You know, that way that's how you're going to be able to help transform your life into the life of your dreams. Being more intentional with everything that you do. Like, for example, I'm going to give you guys an example if you guys really aren't getting me, what I'm trying to say. Um, every morning, when I wake up in the morning, I like to make myself a cup of tea. And it has certain herbs in it so depending on the herbs i set my intentions i activate the herbs i set my intentions on my tea and what i want my tea to do for me when i consume it when i drink it what i want it to do for me spiritually what i want it to do to my body so i'll set i'll stir my tea clockwise and i'll speak and I'll activate all of that. I'll set my intention into my tea. Stirring clockwise because that's how you attract. And I drink my tea and I do that every day. Every day. I do that every day. And now I'm like, I can't even go two days without drinking tea. I have to drink my tea, set my intentions. I feel like that is something that really helps me. So, you know, that's an example. Like, you know, set your intentions on what, whatever it is you want to accomplish within yourself, you know? Okay, moving on. Oh, I also heard be clear with what you want. Okay, Scorpio? So when you're, make, when you're setting your intention for something, be very clear with what you want, all right? Because it's... You want to attract exactly what it is that you desire. <clears throat> Stability. This, this card came out for Aquarius 2, Scorpio. Stability. Staff. So, what I get... What I get for that, for this card, Scorpio, is that I see financial stability for you, Scorpio. Um, there's, there's going to be a lot of abundance and prosperity coming in for you, a lot of opportunities. I see money flowing to you. Um, I see money flowing to you. I see you being very grounded, Scorpio. Very successful. You will be very, very successful, Scorpio, on whatever it is that you decide to do in your in the future, whatever business. It is that you invest all your energy and hard work to. It's going to be very successful, Scorpio. Okay? Very, very, very successful. Oh, I see a lot of opportunities. I feel a lot of abundance and prosperity heading your way, Scorpio. And that's just another reason why you need to seriously start teaching yourself how to protect yourself energetically, spiritually. Okay, you need to be doing protection spells on yourself. You need to be putting protection on your home, Scorpio. Okay? You need to be cleansing your energy, Scorpio, because people are constantly like talking about you. Talking about you, thinking about you, sending you low vibrational energy. But listen, Scorpio, don't even worry about that because you're protected. 
but spirit says you still have to do the work they can't be doing all the work and you're not you know doing anything to protect yourself no okay you need to also protect yourself here in this realm in both realms spiritual and physical but this is how you'll be able to do that okay um your your spirit guides your ancestors they will te they will help they will guide you through this as well they will teach you they will guide you they will literally be your mentors okay and my scorpios that are already working with deities you guys know what i'm talking about because i know my deities they be teaching me mentoring me and i'm so grateful for them but anyways now i'm gonna end your reading with um a question i'm gonna answer a question that you guys been thinking about in your mind okay i'm gonna ask spirit to give me that answer to whatever question you've been thinking you've been having in your mind i'm gonna answer that for you all right okay. oh all right hold on scorpio Hold on, I gotta go pick up those cards, but I wanna show you real quick. Look what, Scorpio, look what's at the bottom of the deck. You think I'm making this this up? <laughs> what does that say? It says candles, and you see candles. Magic, look at the bottom, candle magic. People are doing candle magic on you, Scorpio. This is another reason why Spirit is saying you have to start teaching yourself magic how you can use it to protect yourself because you need to be burning candles for protection to protect your home with your family your union with your divine counterpartner like this is why scorpio because people are constantly attacking you in the spiritual realm they're constantly attacking you it's very important we got to protect our energy scorpio All right, let me shuffle them. We have the temperance. The temperance represents balance. We have the wheel of fortune. The wheel of fortune represents um, a cycle ending, shifting cycles, tables turning, tables turning, surprise of events, good events, and luck so let's move on next card <laughs> the sun card this is three major arcanas scorpio <laughs> like the sun card the sun represents happiness happiness joyfulness and success Scorpio, I'm feeling that something is about to shift your reality in a major, major, beautiful way. You are going to be so happy, Scorpio. You are going to be so, so happy. Wow, I see a lot of success for your future scorpio you're gonna be so successful like holy cow you're gonna be rich some yo scorpio you guys be freaking ready because 
your mind is about to get blown away by from spirit. Spirit's like, surprise. <laughs> surprise. Ah, oh my God, Scorpio. All of these are arcanas. All of these are arcanas. What? Emperor. King. Got the emperor. The sun. Wheel of Fortune. And Temperance. Wow, Scorpio. This is so beautiful. Oh my God. This is so beautiful. Wow. I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so happy. Oh my God. Uh, Scorpio. Ah, how exciting. Your lives are about to freaking transform. First of all, I just want to say this to my masculine Scorpios. Um, you guys, you guys are about to be seen as the true king that you guys are since the day you were born. All the lies, all the rumors that that person was talking about you trying to make you look like you're a, a whole different person a, a terrible person that you were a terrible person first of all all that is being exposed and people are about to be, see the real truth who you really are which is a king and to my ladies to my ladies now i'm going to talk to my ladies to my divine feminine Ladies, I know it's the emperor, but the roles are still vice versa. So any rumors, like I said, any rumors that this person was telling other people, trying to make it look like you're a terrible person, they're about to see that you're the complete opposite of that, that you are the one. And... What I mean by that is that <clears throat> they're going to see that you're actually chosen by the divine. That the divine actually <laughs> is on your side and they blessed you. You are chosen. The divine, you are part of the divine. And they won't ever, ever be able to get close to you ever, ever again. They will never, ever get a chance to taste your energy, your divine, precious energy. They won't ever get to see it, feel it, ever in their lives. And that is gonna kill them inside, Scorpio. That is gonna kill them. I'm telling you, it's gonna kill them inside. Like, I don't even want to get into talking about their energy. Like, I don't even want to get talk into that. Like, they, they going in the trash. <laughs> and they not even going to be here. Someone not even going to be here next year. So, bye. Anyways, back to the reading. Back <laughs> Back to reading about what's coming for you guys. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. That's a confirmation right there. I was about to change the song. <laughs> I was about to change a little Dirk. But the song just said a dead body. You're about to see a dead body. Or, I, you know, I saw a dead body. That's just a confirmation of what I just said, that they're not going to be here. Um, they're not going to be here next year. And this came to me before, but I didn't want to say that. I didn't want to say it because I don't wish death upon nobody. But 
the fact that they won't ever be able to feel touch or get a taste of energy against scorpio and, and it's literally gonna kill them inside it's literally gonna, it's literally gonna be the cause of their death like that's what's gonna cause them to want to die on top of that we got they're about to go to prison scorpio let's not forget that they're about to go to prison so these people they're such a coward that they're not even going to be able to sit there and actually do the time because they're too much of a coward like they'll probably get beat up every single day in prison they gonna get beat up so there we go again dead body dead body this person is gonna die in prison holy cow scorpio <laughs> Spirit is like, don't worry. Listen, don't worry. We getting rid of them for good. They won't ever be coming back. All right. Like, this person won't ever be able to come back. <sighs> wow, Scorpio. Well. They wanted me to, they wanted me to say that. Spirit wanted me to say that. They're like, no, nah, it's okay, you can say it. Alright, Spirit. Um, but yes, Scorpio. They're gonna see. They're gonna find out. Everybody who took sides with them is gonna find out, Scorpio. Your life is about to transform. Okay. Your life is about to transform and you are about to be so happy. You're about to be the happiest you've ever been. Like, you fucking go, God and Goddess. You fucking go because you are on fire. The divine is on your side. You're... This is such a beautiful reading, Scorpio. This is such a beautiful reading, and you guys are truly blessed. You guys, it makes me so happy because nobody deserves to go through this. Nobody deserves to go through this. I, it's sick. Nobody should ever have to go through this. And now this person is about to die in prison, Scorpio. And you are about to be blessed you are about to be beyond blessed. Your life, I'm telling you, your life, your reality is going to transform. Like this, when you receive this, it's going to be a boom. One night you were sleeping in um your old house. Boom. Next thing you know, you move in into a big old mansion in another country somewhere. Or I don't know, you're going off the grid somewhere, building your own house somewhere. Like, what? You're building, oh my God, Scorpio. Empire. You're building your empire. You're creating your empire. All right. Uh, I just said, I just heard, I ain't gonna let no hater stop shit. Hey, you ain't, you ain't letting no hater stop this. Spirit ain't letting no hater stop this, Scorpio. Okay. Huh. <laughs> Yo, Spirit is not playing. Spirit is not playing, Scorpio. Be ready, Scorpio. Well, I love you guys. Um, I'm with you guys go. I hope everyone enjoys the rest of their day and stay blessed. See you in my next video. Bye.